Hello students, my name is Professor Muhammad Asim and we are doing ADMATH. ADMATH for IGCSE students which have syllabus code 0606 and for CIE O level students which have syllabus code uh, 4037. So both kind of students can get equal benefit from this course. Students in last lecture we did question number 3 of exercise 9.5 and the topic is graph of absolute value trigonometric functions today we are going to do question number 4 of exercise 9.5 but before I start this question I always say those students who are watching my lecture first time kindly first go to my playlist there is a folder name is admeth watch previous lectures of this exercise then you will have good command on this topic let's start question number four exercise 9.5 you can see on the screen part a sketch the graph of y equals to 2 plus 3 cos x from the domain 0 to 180 degree so for this domain we can take the interval from 30 30 degrees so I have make uh, the table of X and Y values you can also make the table by X and Y values and you can take another interval as well so no issue uh, now for X 0 30 60 90 120 150 180 and with the help of calculator you can find uh, 2 plus 3 cos 0 you will get 5 2 plus 3 cos 30 you will get 4.6 and so on and finally 2 plus 3 cos 180 you will get minus 1 now plot these values on this axis choice of axis is yours for example, I took 4 squares is 30 degree. You can take 6 square is 30 degree or you can take 2 square is 30 degree. And on y axis, I took 2 square is 1. So it's up to you. For 0, the value is 5. This is the first point. For 30, the value is 4.6, 4, 4.5, 4 4.6. For 60, 3.5, 3, 3.5. For 90, the value is 2. For 120, the value is 0 0.5. For 150, the value is minus 0 0.6. So, this should be just below this square this is the value for 180 the value is minus 1 now join all these points to get the required graph kindly wait and now join this this is your graph y is equals to 2 plus 3 cos x so I hope you completely understand how to draw the graph you can draw a more smooth curve than me because you have pencil and paper come to part b of this question part b is sketch the graph of y is equals to 2 plus 3 cos x modulus or you can say absolute value so this is very easy almost the same graph but two points 
which are below the x axis on this graph you can see on the screen uh, they will reflect on positive axis so all points are same like for 0 is 5 for 0 is 5 for 30 4.6 for 30, 4.5, 4.6, for 60, 3.5, for 90, 2, I will check again, 92, and for 120, 0 0.5, 150 the value is minus 0 0.6 but for this function the value should be positive 0 0.6 this is 0 0.5 this is 0 0.6 for 180 the value is minus 1 and for 180 for this graph the value should be positive 1 now join these points to get the required curve. Here we go. This is the graph of y is equals to 2 plus 3 cos x. So, no difference, only the difference is all the points which are below the x-axis reflect to positive x-axis. That's it. The next part, C, write down the number of solutions of the equation 2 plus 3 sin 2x is equals to 1. Very easy. This is part C. Why? Our question is Y is equals to 2 plus 3 cos x. And the requirement is 2 plus 3 cos x is equals to 1. So, we have to draw a line. y is equals to 1 because if you compare both the equation you will get y is equals to 1 so draw the line y is equals to 1 on this graph So, if you see carefully, both the graph cuts at two points. So, the number of solutions are two. This is our final answer. Values are not required, but only requirement is to write the number of solutions. So, there are two points. between line and the curve and these two points are the solutions I showed for green marker so students this is our today's class where we did question number four now only five six seven eight nine only four questions are left and I will try to finish uh, these four questions as soon as possible so, I hope you completely understand today's class. If you are satisfying my videos and if my videos are helping you, kindly do subscribe my channel. And whenever you subscribe, don't forget to press the bell icon button so that when I upload my video, you will get the notification. 
kindly share my videos my lectures as many as you can okay students good luck for next lecture